Before I start this video, please make sure to not harass anyone mentioned in this video. Also, shout out to Isaac Man for the thumbnail style. Welcome to my party, we're just getting started. A life is a dream or a nightmare scarring. Hand me a drink, cause I think I'm going all in. Get me a shrink, who can catch me when I'm falling? Cover up my scars, flip the handlebars, crashing in my car. Wake up in a bar, I'll be a superstar. Just on my avatar, this world is so right here. The YouTuber who I am going to be talking about is Mango Pool, a YouTuber who posts the strongest Battlegrounds related content. And I have a lot of issues with Mango Pool's content. Let's get into the reasons. So Mango Pool is most known for his one video titled 51 Blocks Fruits Glitches You Didn't Know. And Adam or Mango Pool is showing glitches and myths that are in the Roblox game Blocks Fruits in the video. Now what does this have to do with his thumbnails being extremely vile and terrible? Well look at his third most popular video. <coughs> Disappointment. This man also decides to make disgusting thumbnails, I'll list them here. His thumbnails are just disgusting and the majority of the people who are on YouTube are kids. People in the comments seem to not care. So yeah, Mango Pool's thumbnails are just weird and questionable to say the least. Now on to our next criticism. So my next point into why Mango Pool is a very bad YouTuber is because he clickbaits and lies to his fans in a terrible way. Now you might just be thinking why is every YouTuber clickbaits some point in their videos, right? Well buddy, this man is a clickbaiting king. When I say it, I mean it. Just take a look at his one video. I had the strongest battlegrounds, I dressed up as Tatsumaki to troll my friend x Demon with the new moves. And I caught this man in 4K, he was sipping so hard. I got him to give me a bunch of game passes. He even showed me a secret ultimate Tatsumaki move that nobody has. Bro, we all know that this is not real, bro. Stop clickbaiting. Sigma male. 100, 200. 300. I bet bro's just like counting out the number of push-ups he's doing right now. I'm gonna type, are you single in the chat? Silence. Bro, this animation looks so cool. There's literally like a meteor in the sky. There's like a whole animation for it. Oh yeah, oh yeah. The amount of fake acting in this video makes me believe that he is just doing this because he wants views and money. Another thing to mention is he clickbaits his viewers with characters that are not even added into the game. Let me show examples. I could show more examples, but there is just so many videos to go through. Now this is gonna be our last point, and then our conclusion. So for our final point in this video, is that in most of Adam's videos, he is seen searching up a YouTuber called Pokimane, and whenever he closes out Roblox or does something, he just screams and act like nothing happens. I just find this pretty weird and cringe. I'm here right now, Pookie Bear. And he's telling me to join him. Okay, bet. All right. Let me just leave and join Demon's Game? Bro, what the? Also, doesn't this dude have a girlfriend? Why are you searching Pokimane up? Now, this will be our conclusion. Overall, Mango Pool isn't a very great YouTuber because he just has a passion for clickbaiting, lying, being weird, and also being cringe. I hope you guys enjoyed that video and see you later. You guys can like Mango Pool if you want to. I'm just saying my honest opinion on him. So hit the like and subscribe. This song goes out to my grandma who passed away. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes when I'm lonely, I stick my dick in baloney.